You've hit the wall someplace. You've looked in the mirror too many times and haven't smiled. You want to change the situation. Move from where you are. Fear is self-imposed, meaning it doesn't exist. You create it, you can destroy it too. I love fear. The reason why? Behind every fear is a person you need to be. You face your fears, you become the person you want to be. You run from your fears, you're not living. You're alive, but you're not thinking it's freedom. Like you look at the thing and you say you want to be that, but somewhere in your spirit you feel like, I can kind of do that, but I can't do that, and I can't do that, or I'm not sure if I can do that, is a thing that's stopping you from doing it. Step. Take the step. Step aggressively towards your fear. And that that step towards your fear is the step into bravery. Because we, we're, we're scared of what we don't know. And there is only one way to learn and to know, and that is to confront that fear. You have to step, you have to go. And this simple action, this simple attitude, it answers so many questions. If you face your fears, guys, and fear is destroyed, it comes back in its confidence. Where else am I, where else am I capable of? Where else am I holding my back from that I'm capable of more? Where am I running from I don't need to? Where else can I overcome? When you start believing and start moving, you're going to start getting introduced to opportunities. You're going to start going behind closed doors. You're going to start doing stuff that nobody else is doing. Why? Because don't nobody even know that it's possible. This is just a small group of people that believe that spending time together. And what I'm challenging you to do is to go from average to good, from good to great, and from great to phenomenal. So I need you to do me a huge favor and keep your dreams phenomenal. Keep your vision phenomenal. Keep it phenomenal. And now I need you to get your weight up. As an individual, I need you to get your schedule up. I need you to get your life up. I need you to get your words up. I need you to get your heart up. I need you to get your action up. I need you to get to a place that every single thing that you do is phenomenal so that the life you want to live, you can actually live that life. You go after and you give it all you have. If you lose, at least you try, man. I failed. It's 10 times more of a man than someone said, what if? Because what if never went to the arena? It is the process of the grind that shapes you and forms you. It's not the game. And that's why most of y'all get beat in the game or make mistakes in the game because you think grinding is what happens when the sun comes out. You think grinding is what happens when the lights come on. You think grinding is what happens when people get in the stage. That's not grind. The real grind is in the dark when nobody sees you. What you have to do is you have to mitigate the risk and you have to ease yourself into it, but you gotta go for it. And eventually, you will overcome that fear. But the hard part is, you gotta take that first step. Yeah. You gotta take that first step to begin to inoculate yourself against the fear, against the fear of the thing that's in your mind 